my viewers welcome to next consult tonight is also another day that i'm about to show you how you can add a test capture a live capture to your video so let's say if you're having a program uh, uh, in a church service that or in any program at all that when the people talks you see the test being capturing live beneath the video so take calm and let me walk with you just visit this website webcaptioner.com all right then you just you just sign in into this account okay yes you sign in all right so webcaptioner gives you an opportunity for you to sign in to either facebook to you can you are signing through your facebook or your twitter or your google so i'm signing with my google account all right so stay calm what's a sign with my google account it's being loaded all right so let's wait whilst it loads for us it's very simple and easy but before that don't forget to subscribe to this channel and share this channel for others to also benefit from what we do over here so now it's downloading all right so let's navigate to this small tab over here to the settings option then go to add channel so i've already added a channel to it but let me let me remove the channel okay so you come to settings uh, then you navigate to channels so you click on vmas because the woman is vmas that i'm working on on my next tutorial i'll work on the other ones for your obs so click on vmx okay so it will tell you for it will alert you for you to download a template so click on it so when you click on it it's going to download this one click on it so i've click on it that's where it has downloaded my web captioner title over here so once it's done downloading navigate to your your vmax click on add title and go to title and browse and locate where your title captioner was downloaded and click on open okay so when it's done click on ok all right so here's it so now let's click on it so now we have our captioner over here okay what do we do next let's over around to the web captioner and copy an address and paste it over here how do we do that let's go to the to the vmix and navigate to settings okay at this place settings give me some few minutes settings then go straight to web controller and the web controller make sure this one is ticked all right then you can play around the port you can make it 2023 you can make it 2024 but i'm i'm leaving it just like the way it is so i'll copy it all right make sure all your things are this way okay then let's go straight to the browser and paste it over here click on check so it's successful everything has gone through so let's click on add channel so now that everything is successful let's click on stop captioning and let's see how it works hello you can see that everything is working successful let's go straight to our vmix2 and see you can see that everything is working successful hello all right good so now you you can add your video or let's create something that it can play on it uh, what should I do for color mm, 
let me select some color red okay we go here all right let me edit it for you i'm trying to do something so you just watch me okay good uh what should i do for you then let me go there again uh, let me push it a bit downward okay let me add another one to it okay uh where is it uh, color is going to be transparent okay all right let me add everything on this one multi view uh, this is the color where is the web captioner that's the web captioner all right good so now you can add your camera to it uh, i didn't want to add my camera but for the sake of this tutorial let me add a camera to it so that you see what i'm doing okay good so now my camera is showing all right good uh, let me let me go to the settings and go to position let's go to multi view and add all that i created the color okay good so now you can see everything over here you can see everything you can see everything you see that all my words are working so on my next tutorial i will show you how you can center this test edit it increase the form size to be the way that you want don't forget to subscribe to this video like and share for others to be a blessing bye bye this next concert for you bye bye